Now a drive by Botts. The left hander is up and good. That one will count. Far side Woods misses. Rebound inside Osborne. Jams it home. Far side to Woods. He'll drive it. Force it up. It down. goes down. It's going to count. Clutch play by Woods. Here they come. Nice speed to the baseline. Laid up and in off the glass by Biggs. He has six in the game. It's 52 to 49. Muncie sent this lead down to three. They turn it over again. Steal Logan's port. Penny drives. Scores. It's a one point game with 145 to go. Time out, Muncie Central. Berries can tie with a three. They're doing a nice job with that central defense in their grill. Wild drive, no foul call. Penny couldn't get it. Rebound central. A minute seven to go. 54, 51, number one central over Logansport. Listen to the crowd. They're going crazy. A 10 count against Central. They turn it over again in a critical point in the game. Wow, that's 18 Yeah, just turnovers. a lack of concentration yes, there, Brian. Yes, it was. Maywar, Botts, Jefferson, Mallory, and Allen are out there now for the Bearcats. The clock at 29.1 in the fourth quarter. 54-51 Central ahead, but Penny will shoot. First one. Good. Penny got it to bounce around and go in. He has 20 in the game. He'll have another. It's 54 52. And I imagine they're going to see the, the, the backcourt press again here you right after this free throw. It. You better believe it. Second one, also good. Penny got them both. Give him 21. It's 54 53. Central clinging to a one point lead. They beat the timeline this time. Here's a drive. Shot up. Good by Mallory. He hits it. Give him six in the game. Timeout. Central goes on top. 56 53. 17.8 left in this one. Penny is probably going to end up with the ball. And it comes into him with 17 seconds to go. Here we go, folks. Penny across the timeline. A two won't tie it, but a three will. Logansport looking to tie. Far side. They'll look for the three. It's up. No good. Rebound loose. Picked up by Central. Oh, look at the anguish on Brock Armstrong as he goes down in the crouch. It almost went down. A couple inches away from being a hero. And with 1.6 seconds to go, Central will shoot free throws and can seal it up. Now this will be one in the bonus and not two free throws. That's the eighth team foul by Logansport. So they are clinging to life here. Josh can seal this one up if he could hit even one free throw. Yeah, this first one does it if you could nail it. Yep. A left-hander lets it go. He missed. Time out, Logansport. This will be the longest 1.3 seconds of the season so far for Muncie Central. We, we talked, Scott, you and I before the game. This is an NBA court. It's 94 feet long. It's not 84 feet right. long. And they're going to have to take it an extra 10 feet, Logan Sport is, because they're going to have to take it the length of the floor, inbounding in the central part of the court, in front of the Bearcat bench. This is a catch and shoot if I've ever seen one. A la Christian Leitner. Yes. <laughs> they could run the Bryce Drew play here from Valpo years ago. Comes into Penny. He heaves it. It's short. Central wins. There's the buzzer. This game is over. A barn burner. Muncie Central wins this one. On the Stoops Automotive Scoreboard. Muncie Central 56. Logansport 53.